Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to Two Toe Tags Metal Reviews. And today we're going to be checking out the new song from Hatebreed for the song titled Instinctive Slaughterlust. This is from their upcoming album, Way to the False Self, which is coming out in late November. Now they did release the title track from this album. It was not a music video, so we didn't react. We both hated it. Yeah. Um, main reason being, it feels like budget Hatebreed. It sounds like Hatebreed, but like at the most common denominator, and it just sounds like the most generic kind of thing. Yeah, the best word I would use to describe it was just cringy. It was super cringy. The lyrics were super cringy. It was just, it was the not music good. was like okay. The main thing, the only thing I really liked is that Janie Josta's voice itself sounded good on that recording. I liked sure. that, but other than that, I did not like the song at all. Right. And we're Hatebreed fans, so we're we not both, just like, sitting on it exactly. you know, blah, blah, blah. We both enjoy this bit. We're Hatebreed fans. Very disappointed in that first track. Fingers crossed that this track doesn't disappoint us because I don't want to go down zero yeah, to nothing. That, that would be, uh, yeah, that would be rough. So let's find out. Such a large upgrade from the last song. Dude, this is exactly what I want from this band. This track, this fucking nails it. Yeah. This is exactly what I want. It's got the, the aggression, that fucking just that bounce to it. And the lyrics aren't doofy. Yeah. Oh, man. Like, that was a big part of what the last song was, you know, lacking for me, is that the lyrics were uplifting, which is what the band, you know, does. It's just, it was just way too direct for me, and just yeah. way too simple. This has some poetry to it. It's just that song hits the mark. 
poetry and brutality. Absolutely. And the video was cool. Watching that guy paint that mural yeah. was fucking awesome. Obviously, a very skilled artist because he sure. do the, did the whole logo. Didn't look like he used a stencil at all unless they did some trickery, which they might have. That's okay. Still turned out amazing. Either way, yeah, that looks sick. Yeah, that's uh, maybe they'll make some t-shirts of that. Uh, image because that was a pretty cool fucking that warrior yeah with double with mace double mace with the logo like not only kind of behind him but over him as well that was really cool too the way it kind of bent around it kind of looked i gave it a little bit of dimension 3d almost effect yeah really really cool loved it anyway so it's a plus from us now i'm now i've got a lot more hope for the album coming out for sure late november way to the false self guys that's all we got for you today. Remember to like the video if you liked it. Comment. Tell us in the comments below. Are you guys hyped for this album? That's two songs released. We'd love to hear what you guys have to say. So remember to subscribe if you guys are new. I'm TV Fish. And I'm Vile Self. And keep the horns up.